Hello there. In today's video, I am going to show you how to use the text to speech and speech to text feature of Audio Lab together. Or I can say it vice versa, speech to text and text to speech feature of Audio Lab together. It should actually be speech to text and text to speech uh, feature of Audio Lab. It should not be text to speech and speech to text. Okay. So now, as you people know that I had made two separate videos on both the features. Uh, one was how to convert text to audio using Audio Lab, and the second one was do fast typing uh, using Audio Lab uh, for blind users. Uh, that kind of title was there. So those videos were based on these two features. Now let's see. In this new update of Audio Lab, Audio Lab has added a feature wherein you can use text to speech with speech to text okay so let's see how that is i'll open audio lab folder open audio lab audio lab audio lab play games convert i will go to speech to text text to speech video carry speech to text column 2 Speech to text. Navigate up. Speech. S tap on mic. Start recording button. Button. Double tap to activate. And uh, as I have opened this uh, here, there is a start recording button. And I can start speaking the thing, uh, whatever I want, and it will write it for me. And then, besides that, now there is a one more button coming. Send text to text to speech. Now what will happen over here is whatever text we write in this box, okay, in this uh, voice input, via this voice input, we can send that text to text to speech and convert that text only to audio. So that is how it works. If you want, you can watch the two separate videos which I had created on text to speech and speech to text. So you might as well understand the concept better. And on... Uh, Audio Lab is a very useful application. So I have made a, a, a playlist on Audio Lab. So you can watch uh, that playlist as well. That is all the videos in that playlist. Okay. So now let's start. I will uh, I will click on the mic, the start recording button and say uh, some some things. Reset. Start recording button. Button. Double tap to activate. Hi, everyone comma if you've liked my video comma so please give me a thumbs up comma and don't forget to subscribe if you have liked my video tap hi everyone if you like my video so please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you have liked my video tap start re reset i will reset it start tap on make to speak start re Hi everyone, comma, if you have liked my video, comma, so please give me a thumbs up, comma, and don't forget to subscribe, comma, if you have any doubt, comma, then you can write it in the comment section down below, comma, I will try to answer it soon, comma, thanks for watching, comma, bye bye. And now let's see whether the correct text has been written or not. Tap hi everyone. If you have liked my video, so please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. If you have any doubt, then you can write it in the comments section down below. I will try to answer it soon. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. Double tap to active. Tap on me. Now there is a reset button. Start the record. Reset button. And send text to text to speech button. Double tap to activate. This is the new button which has come. Send text to text to speech. Please make sure that you have kept your uh, audio lab up to date. I will provide the link in the description box for you to install audio lab. So please make sure that you have kept audio lab up to date. And then you might get this feature. So now uh, I will as I click on this, 
see what will happen the same thing will happen which used to happen in uh, text to speech uh, when we used to convert text to speech in audio lab so a uh, complete action using will come now complete action using commentary sam now i have to select a text to speech engine with which i have to complete action for voice multilingual smart voice speech services by google column 4 internet connection required for text to speech now uh, in the edit box where we used to write our text or paste our text the text which we had said in the voice input has already come let's see volume but import text info but hi everyone if you have liked my video so please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you have any doubt then you can write it in the comments section down below i will try to answer it soon thanks for watching I buy edit box add text and then play double tap to edit text double tap output so as you saw in the edit box the text came now let's play and check download pitch what speed 50 per 1 play button hi everyone if you have liked my video so please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you have any doubt then you can write it in the comments section down below i will try to answer it soon thanks for watching bye bye so this was a very cool voice of google actually uh, and so as you saw the a uh, text played properly save button double tap to activate and i can save also so i will save hi everyone if you have liked music create and the same thing is coming which used to come in text to speech let's save audio lab Hi everyone! If, hi everyone! If you have liked my navigation, oh. Okay, so the audio has been generated. Let's see. Folder, apps, Google, Sam, voice recorder, my phone, my phone, more apps, recent. Hi everyone! If open with audio lab, mini. Hi everyone! Mini if you have liked my video, so please give me a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe if you have any doubt. Then you can write it in the comments section down below. I will try to answer it soon. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. Unlabbed up. My files. Navigate up button. Double tap to activate. Double tap and hold. Record button. Record. Okay. So that is how it works. So that is how you can use both the features of Audio Lab together. you can uh, type using the voice input of audio lab that is using a uh, speech to text and then after typing you can simply convert it to uh, audio by clicking on that send text to text to speech button okay and that is how you can use both the features of audio lab together so this was it for today's video until next time bye bye hi everyone if you like my video so please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you have any doubt then you can write it in the comments section down below i will try to answer it soon thanks for watching bye bye